two income part one where the schedule c rolls into line three business income or loss from the schedule c here is a schedule c profit or loss from business having the p l profit and loss or income statement format of an income minus expenses so now we're continuing on with our discussion of accounting methods given the fact that the schedule c is of course a type of financial statement in essence basically an income statement as opposed to the other major type of financial statement the balance sheet and it is representing performance over a time frame therefore we need to have some kind of accounting that we're going to be doing in order to guide us in terms of how we're going to be putting the income statement together our regulations come from the tax code but of course the tax code might be deferring to standard kind of accounting regulations and authorities the primary two types of methods we use cash method and accrual method or possibly some kind of hybrid between them noting that the major things that would push us from going from a cash method the easier method typically to an accrual method are when our business our industry have accrual type of things we need to deal with such as inventory because it's going to go on the books as an asset typically when we purchase it which is a deviation from a cash-based accounting thing to do and when we buy large things like property plants and equipment in that case even if on a cash based system we would have to put it on the books basically as a balance sheet or on the tax return as a depreciable asset allocating the cost in accordance with the depreciation rules that also being a de deviation from a cash based system